Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. This is Monkey Talk. Today we're going to talk about something every Bamboo P1 and X1 owner needs, but maybe doesn't think about enough. The good old poop bucket. Yeah, you heard that right. Your printer's got a poop, and if you don't give it a place to do that, well things can get messy real quick. So what exactly is a poop bucket? Basically, it's a container that catches all the filament waste that your P1S spits out during purges, color changes, or when it's cleaning the nozzle. The printer has to push out the old filament before switching to the new one, and all of that excess plastic has to go somewhere. If you don't have a dedicated poop bucket, it just piles up inside the printer, which can clog things up, mess with the print bed, or even get tangled in your parts. Having a poop bucket keeps everything neat and organized, instead of having random strings and blobs of filament all over the place. They're all contained in one spot. This makes it easier to clean, helps your printer last longer, and honestly, it just saves you headaches. Think of it like this, would you rather deal with one neat trash can or tiny piles of garbage scattered all over your house? Yeah, exactly. I'm not saying it will get rid of all of it, because you still will get tiny pieces under the print bed, but it's way more manageable. Now here's the fun part. You can actually get creative with your poop bucket. Some people 3D print fancy bins or design cool little compartments that fit perfectly onto the printer. You can even recycle some of that filament waste into other projects if you've got the right tools. Plus. If you're showing off your setup to friends, it's way cooler to point to a clean bucket than a messy printer full of plastic spaghetti. So yeah, it might sound silly, but the poop bucket is one of the simplest upgrades you can make to your Bamboo P1 setup. It keeps your workspace clean, keeps your printer happy, and saves you from unnecessary frustration. If you don't already have one, trust me, your future self will thank you. In the description, I have added the poop bucket that I printed, along with total print time, settings, filament used, and a link to the model. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and drop a comment below if you've got a creative poop bucket design of your own. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Happy printing.